Hi everyone, in this video we will see about uh, the conditional formatting. Conditional formatting means this option is used to uh, highlight the cells with some specific conditions. Okay, and this conditional formatting option will be there in the home screen itself. In the home screen itself, here you can see the option of the conditional formatting. Let us see how to use the conditional formatting. So for that I have collected the data that is uh, I have the marks of the students for IA1, IA2 and uh, even I have the assignment marks and uh, in one more sheet uh, I have the sales data. I have the sales data. So how to use this conditional formatting for this data we will see. Okay. Now this IA2 is connected for total 100 marks. Okay. Now I want to know who are all the students who have failed in IA2. Means who are all the students who have got less than 35 marks. For that we will use conditional formatting option. Okay. Now what you have to do is you have to select all the numbers. All the numbers. Now click on conditional formatting. Okay. Highlight cell rules less than 35. Less than 35. So you can change the color, uh, highlighting color. So by default it has taken red. We can change it to yellow. Here you can see it is changing. Okay, I will choose the red only. Say okay. Now you will get now for all the members we have got less than 35 marks now. All the students marks we have got less than 35 will be highlighted. Okay. Now what I will do is I will clear this condition formatting. For that also you have to select all the numbers. So here clear rules. Okay. Clear rules from the selected cells or the entire sheet. Okay. I'll select uh, the selected cells only. Okay. If you want to, if you applied conditional formatting for the entire sheet, no, you can uh, clear the uh, conditional formatting rule which is applied for the entire sheet as well. Okay. Now, I want to know who are all the students who have got uh, more than first class, means more than 60 percent, means more than 60 marks. Okay. That is also possible by using this conditional formatting option. I have to select all the numbers. Select all the numbers. Go to conditional formatting. Highlight cell rules greater than 60. Greater than 59. 59. Okay. Now, all the cells which are uh, greater than 59 means from 60 onwards. All the numbers have been selected here. Okay. So in this way we can highlight the cells with different different conditions. Okay. I will clear the conditional formatting now. Clear from the entire sheet. Now let, let us see what are, which are all the other options. Greater than is over, less than over. Between. If you want to know who are all the members who got marks between uh, 70 to 100. Let us see. Conditional formatting, highlight cell rules between between 75 to 100. If you want, you can change the color yellow. You can see the other numbers which are between 75 to 100 have been highlighted. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 members have got more than 75. Okay, 70 means uh, got 75 uh, between 75 to 100. Okay. Now, which is the next option? Equal to. Equal to. Let me clear the rules. Now, if you want to know the members who have got the mass which is equal to 50. Okay. 50. Same procedure. Select all the numbers. Select all the numbers. Conditional formatting. Highlight cell rules equal to type 50 50 say okay 
Uh, there are quite a good number of members. We have got 50 members. 1, 2, 3, 4. 4 members have been highlighted. Overall got the, got the 50 members. No? That is highlighted. Okay. Next. Next option is uh, text that contains. For this, uh, I will go to this uh, sale data. I will go to sale data. Now, I want to select the name of only Martha, the text that contains, uh, the cell that contains the Martha name. Okay, for that, I will select this whole column. Conditional formatting, highlight cell rules, text that contains, by default it has taken Martha. Okay, if you want to highlight the cells which contains the name Timothy, that also you can type. Timothy, okay, see you can see the text, the cells which contains the name Timothy have been highlighted. Okay, next is uh, conditional formatting with respect to the date. Okay, with respect to date. Okay, here I have some set of dates. I will select all the dates. I will select all the dates. Okay. Today's date is January 22, 2024. Now I want to uh, highlight the cells with the date occurring in the next week. Okay. Click on that. Say OK. So next week, all the next week dates have been highlighted. Okay. Or else if you want to highlight the dates occurring in the next month. Occurring in the next month. Next month. You can select that also. So the date which are all uh, the, the coming in next month will be highlighted. Okay. So this is about uh, uh, highlight cell rules and we have one more option that is duplicate values. Duplicate values means see you can see the Martha the name Martha is appeared more than two times. Okay. More than one time. Okay, if, if a name or if a content that appears more than one time means it will consider it as duplicate, that duplicate uh, uh, things it will show. Okay, for example, Mars, no? Here, I want to, if I want to know uh, the duplicate values, okay, that means uh, the 50, number 50, okay, which is uh, repeated more than one time, okay, you need to select the full. Uh, numbers or I'll select some subset of the numbers conditional formatting highlight cell rules duplicate values okay say okay now 69 is repeated two times 50 number 50 is repeated around three times all the duplicate values will be highlighted here Okay, with respect to this IMRs, actually it is not applicable. In some specific conditions, uh, if you want to know the duplicate values or duplicate text, that that is possible using this uh, duplicate uh, values option. Okay, so I'll clear the rule now. Enter sheet. So next is uh, highlighting the uh, top 10 items, okay, bottom 10 items, top 10%, bottom 10%, okay, let us see that. <coughs> I'll select all the numbers, all the marks. Now I want to know which are all, who are all the top 10 members, okay. Go here, top 10 items, say okay. Top 10 items will be selected, okay. Top 10 members will be so who are all got 
highest marks will be highlighted okay this 19 is by default it is uh, red i'll make it uh, black okay i'll clear the rules if you want to know bottom 10 members okay select all the values select all the values i'll make this also black Select all the values, conditional formatting, bottom 10 items, say so, okay. Overall got less marks now, bottom 10 members will be selected, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 10 members, bottom 10 members will be selected. Next is top 10 percent means here total I have around 60 number of data 60 number of data I'll select all the number all the data go to conditional formatting top 10 percent save ok ok total there are around 60 number of data is there 10 percent of 60 means how much around 6 to 7 members total actually 63 63 members are there 10% of 63 means around 6 point something so around 7 members will come so top 10 percent of the data will be selected 1 2 3 4 5 6 total 6 members means around 60 10% uh, of 60 members means 6 members 10% of 60 means 6 members Top six members will be selected. Top six members will be selected. I'll clear the rule. Now, now if you want to know the bottom ten percent members, okay, select all the numbers again. Select all the numbers, condition formatting, bottom 10%. Okay. Bottom 10%. Save so, okay. okay. Bottom 6 members. 10% of 60. In 6 members. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Bottom 6 members means 10% of 60 means 6 members. Bottom 6 members will be selected. So what is next option? Let us see. Above average and below average is there. See, if I select this full data, in the bottom right corner, it will give sum and average. Average of all the numbers. Actually, the average of all the numbers is 52. Around 52 is there. Okay. If you want to highlight the numbers which are above average means above 52 number okay you can click on this for all the members who got above 52 marks now will be highlighted okay the similar rule is applicable for below average below average Okay, so all the members who, who have got less than 52, no, 52 point something, all the numbers will be highlighted. Okay, this is about uh, the conditional formatting. Thank you.